Hello there and welcome back to Going Medieval. Now I know it's been a very long time since we've done a video on this game and uh, I'm sure you know exactly why it's been like this as well. But uh, let's jump into this episode and there's a couple of uh, things we need to discuss. First of all, I think our castle is now pretty much complete how we did want to have it. And yes, I wanted to expand it as much as we could, but I feel we might not be able to do so. Now, if you have been following the game developers updates and news, then it seems there is a big update or a patch coming soon, which will break the current save game. So all these new uh, content that they are putting into the game is unfortunately, yeah, it's, a, it's not going to be compatible with any old saves and you have to start a new game. So unfortunately, we will not be able to enjoy anything or everything new in, in this game. But uh, that's okay. I think our castle is at the level where we want it anyways. And I also feel like recording videos for this is, uh, is a little tricky. I don't want them to be boring. And um, I think you've already seen pretty much everything the game has to offer. I mean, if we go through, let's take a look. We've built pretty much everything that we want to I believe so at least yeah yes looks like we have everything and yeah okay now before we go into our last final touches into this game there is something else I'd like to show off I think the last time we uploaded an episode for going medieval was about a month or two months ago actually and we do have a wonderful submission from bikini pro he's drawn us a bit of a comics and I really loved it when I when I saw him posted on on discord and that pretty much sums up our last episode and this is baby baby dragon planning and giving orders to all the colonists and here goes baby dragon okay so we need to clear out the north wall make it not dirt this last quadrant is going to be a market or a park or maybe both my lord what is the construction out back for again hmm oh that one uh don't worry it is temporary <laughs> honestly this is amazing. Both the storyline and the drawing skills as well. I, I really mean it. I think it's very, very wonderful how you've drawn out the impressions as well, because that's pretty much how Baby Dragon looks as well when he's trying to plan all this construction there and with the deer cult that happened in the last one. Yeah, the answer to this is I don't think it's going to be a temporary one because um, now that we are looking to close out the series, we are going to leave this uh, this little stairway to heaven for the for the deer. They really seem to love it, so why not? Okay, so going into an episode, I think it's going to be a little bit shorter this time around as well, so I do apologize for that, but, uh, you know, at least it's nice and uh, nice and concise and short and quick. Right, so for the deer, I think there's a couple of decorations we still need. Maybe a few banners that tell everyone to be aware of this area in here. So first of all, why don't we start with which way are they going? This way facing, okay, perfect. Few flags is definitely what we need. Few warning flags for anyone that trespasses into this area. Which way? Oh, you are facing the wrong way. Well, that's okay. We'll just get rid of you and maybe try and construct another one. I hope we have the cloth and the materials that we need for these. Uh, okay, so we've got a couple of flags. Maybe a bit too close, but that's okay. And then we'll have a second set. Let's do it right about right about there okay that's that's beautiful few warning signs and maybe even few pyres here as well just to make it even even scarier for all the trespassers uh, because i believe those deer they don't mess around you go into this area and well they're gonna have a little campfire for you not gonna tell you what's uh what's gonna be cooked on the campfire but we should definitely look out now, where do we have... Okay, torches as well. Yeah, we definitely are going to have... Have to have a couple of wooden torches here and there. Okay, couple there. Oh, and here we go. Okay, we'll leave this be. Maybe speed up the time a little bit as well. Okay, there we go. Now, yeah, we'll leave the set list to construct everything in here. And I've done a few minor touch-ups since we... Well, yeah, I... Since we last recorded, so schedules... No, not this one. I think under the management here. Right, so with, with the clothes, I think you all know almost every second or third episode, I was reminding myself on the videos that, oh, we should definitely look at the, the armor and clothes and everything and try and give them slightly better quality. So I've done that off camera. That's why some of them don't have armor. I think they've pretty much grabbed everything else they need right now. Well, you don't seem to have a weapon... 
Okay, so maybe you just don't have enough right now, but that's okay. So yeah, I've gone through, made sure that everything is high uh, quality. And now looking at the buildings as well, I think we did want to decorate this church a little bit. And it seems right here, well, it's a little difficult to get the right angle. We were also destroying these floors, right? There you go. Maybe three times the speed since it's evening already. And this chimney over here, that was also a bit of a struggle. So I think what we'll do is we'll leave it as it is and just imagine that there is a, that's actually a functioning chimney, chimney. So yeah, let's leave it at that. What I'll have to do is maybe close this up a little bit. Oh, quick autosave. There we go. Drake has turned at 32 today. Wonderful. Now, I believe if we deconstruct everything, I've also fo forgotten all the shortcuts in this game as well. X is to demolish. Okay, there we go. Wonderful. Uh, we should be able to. Can we just copy this? Yes, we can. Okay, fantastic. There we go. Let's put the floor over there again. And now what we can do is, let's grab a couple of those Merlons. And we've used clay over there, so we shall do the same on this side as well. Okay, off you go, construct that section, that's gonna be wonderful. Now 5am, beautiful fog, and the summer has started now. Okay, now I think another thing, or well, another problem that we overlooked a little bit is the seeds. Throughout winter, the settlers were planting different kinds of crops and they kept dying which means we lost a lot of seeds as well, so we don't really have a huge crop in here. The one we have is barley, yeah, but that's not going to be too useful for food, wasn't it? Got some beets in, so that's okay, and some cabbage as well. Same with carrots. So we might not be too bad. I mean, looking over here, we should have quite a few ingredients. Let's see, a red currant, well, cabbage a little bit. Yeah, well, that will be plentiful to last us uh, at least till the end of this episode, so... One last thing that we do have to construct or finish here is we need a bit of a roof uh, above our head. So why don't we finish this section as well. Please do get this in. And I also feel this church area, even though this is very beautiful, it's looking very lovely and nice. It's a little incomplete, so we'd uh, definitely benefit from a few decorations around this area as well. So why don't we... Put a few banners. Let's see. Yeah, that seems to be okay. And maybe even, can we do some wooden wall torches as well outside? Couple by the doors. Maybe not so much over here, actually. Let's take this one out. And we could do a few more banners. I really hope we have enough. Let's put a couple here, actually, as well. All right, there we go. Bring the layers down. Yep, that seems to be all beautiful. And we're getting beeswax. You take beeswax, right? Yeah, okay. Cool. Yeah, yeah, sorry, I've just forgotten a few things, so do have to double check now, every now and then. And looks like we do have a few flags already in, which is great. One of the buyers, and just a few more flags to go, so I think we're pretty, pretty happy with this area as well. Now, another thing to add in here is maybe even a bit of a bit of a fencing to block this area in. Let's do it like so. Just a few, nothing too fancy, and we'll try and keep anyone, uh, you know, that's not supposed to go in there out from this area, if we can, of course. I mean, it's not gonna happen realistically, but at least we've tried to do our best to keep everyone safe. And it seems we do have one more set of stairs that has to go as well. Okay, now a bit of flooring, and voila, this is looking lovely. They're getting some of the Merlons in. It is a heat wave now, 40 degrees in some areas. Ooh, that is that is quite uh, quite warm. Okay, checking at the towers, everything looks good. And yeah, I think we can sign this off now. Ooh, wait a second. A few roof bits here that need to be changed as well with this style. And I think we had, yeah, we had this one. Okay, that looks pretty much complete now. I mean, yes. It is not. There's a few more sections here and there, but... And we got this little tunnel that goes into our castle as well. It would be lovely to put a few doors here, actually. Yeah, let's do that. Let's do that very quickly. I don't think they have to be the strongest ones. Oh, these are windows. That's okay. Let's uh, get the normal doors. 
And the reason for that is, oh, that's a little bit difficult. If we go down a few levels, the walls are right about here. So we can put them in place, right? Yeah, that's correct. Okay, we've got the doors in place now. And hopefully the deer that are outside, they're not going to wander through those doors anymore. But okay, the evening is uh, slowly setting in. The settlers are completing their final tasks. And this means as the settlers get ready for bed, so is unfortunately this playthrough as well. It has been a lot of fun playing this game. I really do love it. And I'd like to give a massive thank you to all of you that have been following this series with us as well and giving us a lot of recommendations and ideas how should we proceed. I mean, this whole area here was built thanks to your ideas. So, so yeah, thank you so much for following. I hope you had fun with us throughout this series. I'm really sorry it's been so such a short episode but yeah i think we're pretty much done with this so so this is baby dragon signing out thank you so much for for being with us and i look forward to seeing you in our future adventures <laughs>